I come to Aaron's house at like 10 o'clock to grab the quad cortex. He's going to Orange County this weekend. So I grabbed the quad, quad cortex to make some music this weekend. Next thing I know, we're like basically talking about content for, for like 40 minutes and then we're talking about doing like we're talking about like what's the what's the dj vocal video and i, I want to just get the camera yeah look at this dude yeah look at like, this look just like coming over here yeah yeah, yeah. No, look, for sure how much of a vibe is that you know that is such a because you get this the gentle x speakers are like right there too yeah could also be from this other angle as well because like if you close this uh, oh oh my goodness oh my goodness <laughs> From this vibe, yeah, you know, totally. Nah, but the other one looks a little. Yes, yeah, so I don't know what it, what what about it is. That's wait, weird. I could also like. I think it's this wall. Yeah. And that but, chair. But check. But wait, wait, wait. If you do that, and then you. We fucking vibe out the kitchen with a cool. Yeah. Do you, uh, all these lights on a vibe thing? You can, I can set them up to one. You can go. You can do this. Yeah, it's pretty fucking sick. But you would also like, do... look, it, this is cool too. And then it you shows... can do a fill light here, you know? Oh yeah. It shows the speakers, it shows the deck, it shows the furniture, and then at the same time, it shows like your entire house. Yeah, you just with do with the black walls, all the pictures and the red carpet. Yeah, some that kind of like, you know. Dude, that is a total vibe. Yeah. When you get back, we'll, we should definitely do some Ohio Riz stuff to test it. Yeah. You know what I mean? And we we can we can literally, you know, it would it would it, we could literally. I mean, the only thing I'm thinking about too is is to we should probably we could do one where we just have it out out of the speakers, but I think it would be better to have to record the audio. Oh, through this. Yeah. I just do both. You know, just like how do, how do we do that? What's the best way to do that? Through the out of the the mixer. Into what though? Into a computer? Well, I have a fucking. There's a there's field, a mic. I have a field recorder that okay. I can just already do. You know, there's like, also a mic input on here. Yeah. I wonder if you could do that. That Probably. would be that would be so silly. You could record it. I, you can make it your audio through the phone. You can record it to your phone too. I know there's a way to do that. Well, I have the, the record the, box app. The, there's the DJ record. Yeah, I record make I record my mixes to my phone and send it to Dropbox and then just do the EQ adjustments and shit from there. Yeah. You know, or whatever the fuck, you know. So there will be a slight best practices to set up, but I think, I mean, I think it would be worth it I just truly, to spend an hour and get no, and get I, a 30 second clip of Ohio Riz. I truly think though, this is three, this is three cameras. Well, this we is do. the end game. This is where it should go. Because eventually you would have a camera here, camera here, and a camera there. I and think, you could actually do yeah, like... I think a camera here and a camera here is perfect. And then it would... It would and then maybe even a camera. Yeah. But then you're what, running, but then you can run, you know. You know what I was also thinking? Like, remember how that one time we had, it was Lexi, your cousin, Jeremy, and I think Terrence was here too. I don't know if yeah, Terrence yeah, was here. Yeah, yeah, he was here. He but was just here. like really, really, really small. I want to call it, it's a party, but really, really small. A get together. Yeah. A gathering. And yeah. You, you could do like. And just film we're, that. We're, 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 yeah, we're having like, we're doing, we're recording a live mix. So we're going to mix all night. Yeah. But okay. then in the middle, we're going to do like a live set for audio erotica we yeah. just want everyone kind of hanging out yeah well we're mixing and everyone's yeah. having a good time exactly it would look great it would be so sick but how sick would it be if you had your okay this is what would be the the three camera way if that's what you're thinking the three camera way is is there's an up an up down from like the typical boiler room up down mm -hmm. there's a camera there that gets everybody over here mm -hmm. the, the whole living room because then you're catching everything that's interesting behind you yeah everything's interesting over there and then one that faces this way because this is the interesting angle yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you have your interesting angle, your boiler room angle, your party angle. Oh yeah, yeah, that would be fucking sick. Cause then, then it would the dogs be. Dogs will be, cats will be walking around. Yeah, dogs be chilling. People will be chilling. It would have like a a this repetitive is... vibe to it that you could routinely do. Yeah, you know what I mean. Well, at that point, if we have that set up, it's literally just. And here's the thing that I think would be cool. Audio erotica is a Carson City thing. Yeah. So it's like, this is an audio erotica thing. This is in Carson City. You have this is us in. hanging out yeah. and doing this thing. You know what I mean? And it would just be... Well, imagine when Caleb and comes and visits or other audio, or like even at the other techno or proco that we work with that we're releasing with comes and stays. And then they come and it's like, hey, record, get on the deck. Yeah, let's, let's, let's record a hangout. Yeah, we're, we're going to do this, this, and this. And then we're going to have like a dinner and people come over yeah. and like, you know, we're going to barbecue or whatever and yeah. literally just like... Do the, how, how we've been doing that. That's how kind of we started doing... When yeah. 
Audio Erotica was first starting, we were doing that like maybe once a month, maybe once every other month. We'd yeah. get together and we'd just all mix and hang out and stuff. Yeah, with everybody. It's like that kind of vibe. Well, that's what that's what we talked about everything a lot too. And exactly. Like, well, this is what it was. So kind of the idea was built. Exactly. You know? so, or like that last time when Joe was here and, and uh, Caleb was here. Yeah, and everybody like, was just vibing. That would have been a perfect time to do, do it, it, you know? Because like we were all hanging out. It just would have been like, okay. And I already started mixing. And anytime we're, we're hanging out, I always start record, mixing. Yeah, we just need to record. It. We, but it, that's we, what, but we that's, need to get it. But that's what I'm saying. Like the, that's when you. It's hard to do when you're like, oh, I got it. But if you just like think about it, any time that if this is set up or once this is set up, well, that's the reason why we got it is to come up here, just press record. If I'm practicing mixing, if I'm doing anything, or if I got to just do anything, or we're doing what we were doing, mm -hmm. you always just press record. Always. And then you just then you just do it, and you never know. Yeah. It's like when, when it would I, be sick. It's like when I get the my own little Cortex set up. If I'm ever practicing guitar jamming or whatever, and I feel like playing, I'm just gonna plug into the Cortex and record it every fucking time. Exactly. And if I really want to be extra, I'll record it and then I'll turn on the fucking Elgato shit and then record, you know, mm -hmm. what I'm doing so I don't forget. Like, what did I do? You know, like yeah. Because there's some riffs already, you know, from a few months back where I'm like, damn it, how did it? Where, yeah. Where did it go? Yeah. I, I just love how we went from like, hey, I'm, I'm coming over, pick up the Cortex. What are you gonna do with the Cortex? Oh, oh yeah, I'm just gonna do some content. We, we talk about content forever, and then we talk about the vocal videos, and then I'm like, yeah, I wonder what the, the vocal video version for EDM even is. And it's like, this is it. <laughs> this is the vocal video. Because it makes sense. Because like a vocal video, it's like a performance thing, right? Yeah. It's like a, a bedroom version of what you would be doing on a stage, basically. Exactly. And this, this is, is like bedroom. a bedroom version of what you'd be doing on a stage. Stage. This is the bedroom version of what you do on stage. Exactly. So that's that's it right there. That's that. This is it. You know? Yeah, it'd be sick. And then like when we're doing these things too, we can bring over Cam every day and like have like an, a vlog at the same time. Yeah, doing everything. Yeah. And then on YouTube you can have like the related videos too. Yeah. And then so it'd be, be the like, here's, a, the, here's the vlog. Yeah. The BTS, BTS. You know, this. Uh, Big Chocolate live at Audio Erotica HQ or whatever. And then it's like a, you know, whatever, however long mix or whatever. And it doesn't need to be like specific towards like a Big Chocolate set. It could be kind of like those weird sets we play here sometimes. Yeah, where, they, where they, nobody really knows what the, we're just, we literally sometimes will go from like, you are playing some fucking like cumbia shit. And then we're playing hard dance to drum and bass, then to like... Then to God smack. Exactly, literally. That's what, you know, then, yeah. then you're putting on active rock, and then fucking, then somebody comes in with like some other shit, and then it's like, oh, you're right, that would be really kind of cool, interesting thing. Yeah, like, then you vlog the whole thing too. So you, you have, can't really monetize it, but you know, fuck it, it's cool. Fuck it, yeah, it's cool. It gives me those, you know... Just put, cool, cool kid vibes. Exactly. It's one of those things, if you're consistent with it over like the course of like cool a year, it would be like, in not a only a great archive, but it would be... So Sick. It's just sick. Well, also, people, like, I watch, you know, I watch mixes on YouTube. Like, people that, you know, I follow channels that are a place that people go to mix. And they, you know? Mm hmm So it's just, we're always just like, so much, like, so into what everything else that we're always doing. It's like, oh, yeah, we got to add another thing and another thing. Yeah, but these things we're going to be adding, like this thing, is that once it's added and once it's figured out, oh, it's, it's really easy, to, it's easy to just do it. It's easy. You know? It's like getting back into cam every day. Like getting back exactly. into, the, getting back into the, the mentality of picking up the camera to record it. Exactly. To to it. it probably took a second to be like, to just think about, because now you're getting very, just, I, you just oh, I need the camera. You like even last night, you're showing me the flutes and stuff. I was like, had my backpack on. I was like ready to go. And then like, I'm like, I should just, take the camera out like this is this is worth filming you, like things like moments like that yeah where instead of thinking that you just, just go and do, do it. it you just do that's it. that's that and then you know if you know what cam every day is it's not going to be weird when it happens oh, oh my pumpkin. god that's the weirdest thing i've ever seen in my life you know pumpkin has that like funny face <laughs> You, you don't have a funny face. Like, the way, the way the face was really up close, it looks really funny. That is a funny cat. Look at her, look at her little boots. Yeah, but that, that would be a, a, a whole vibe. And it's like, you know, we're talking about like these like, oh yeah, YouTube channel, this, all these things, a vlog and all this stuff. It's like, we, we started off talking about a short, you know what I mean? And like the short, if you just get the short out of it and that short becomes a thing that helps promote or visualizes that there's a release. Yeah. I think it's, it's important. Yeah, 
because like we we do these visualizers, which is great, but there's there's so many of them. Yeah. I think, and I think like a, it's like the same thing of like me doing a visualizer for a disfiguring thing and be like new disfiguring out now versus if I just did like a vocal video for like ten seconds of a disfiguring song, it like that's be, obviously gonna chart better. Yeah, it's gonna chart way better. So I think I think doing like a like that one dude on TikTok who does those goofy ass videos. I can't remember his name. Yeah, but he just but puts that on format is his. perfect. It's I mean obviously you're not gonna jack his thing because he's he's talking about shit from like his the day. 90s yeah. and he's, he's, get, he's he kind does of a like historian. 12 a day exactly he's, he's more of like a dance music oh my goodness <laughs> but this is like exactly he's like dance, he's a dance music historian this he really is, just, is. You know? but this is like like think about like the big c instagram like we've already talked about this but it's like it's so metal driven and then i post like an ohio wrist thing it's like yeah everyone fucks with it there's a lot of people who follow me who are into dance music and, and all that but it's like you would really visualize especially it reminds me of old school arg on youtube when i would do vocal videos and then i got cdjs and i do random 10 minute mixes yeah and that's what kind of like well, the people oh he's a dj it. too yeah. and it's like that's that's the thing that they're like yeah. oh he's a dj too it just it puts this weird thing together for people you know and for the project really it goes both ways yeah true truly what is this oh, what the heck is that oh it's this crazy fucking oh it's a book yeah. i thought it was music no 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 it's like uh like i believe it's like a fucking metal Ooh. like it's got like like fucking just that is so sick dude i also have another one by the same company i, th I think it's the same company but it's it, like it's an album artist it's album art yeah it's just and it talks about you know all of the, the fucking dude some of these are nuts i don't yeah. i don't recognize a single one either what's that about that's crazy to me you know yeah i don't recognize a single logo but they're all like some of the coolest logos i've ever seen yeah wait wait go back one cerebral boar it's the only one i've recognized so far yeah i'm sure if you went through this it. this looks familiar dude that's a dope book and there's another one that's pretty much the same thing but it's all album art like album covers same company oh man so big slime today so big slime <laughs> what a vibe big slime the dome of the northern nevada metal sound oh speaking of that 